If you notice blue fluid leaking at the front of your car, you might need to replace your washer fluid reservoir. Your washer fluid reservoirs can fail over time due to harsh environments, which causes them to crack. Hi, I'm Barbara Terry with AutoMD. 98% of our driving decisions are based upon visibility. If your washer fluid reservoir fails, you will not be able to clean off your windshield. Parts and tools needed. For this project, you will need the following parts. Replacement washer tank, washer fluid, retaining cap, bolts or screws. You will also need the following tools. 3 8 inch ratchet, sockets, screwdriver, shop racks. Your own vehicle's components and parts may differ, so always refer to your vehicle's owner's manual for details. For your safety, we recommend wearing safety glasses, latex gloves, and closed-toed shoes when working on your vehicle. You'll first want to locate your washer fluid reservoir if you're not really for sure where it's at. Always refer to your owner's manual. Then you'll need to inspect it for leaks. Then, remove the old washer tank. Remove the wiring to the washer pump. Transfer the washer pump to the new washer tank. Next, reconnect the wiring to the washer pump. Install the new washer tank. Finally, fill the new washer tank with fresh windshield washer fluid. Remember to test the windshield washer. If the windshield washer does not appear to be washing the windshield properly, it will be necessary to adjust the jets by using a medium-sized safety pin. Place the pin into the jet and gently move the jet to aim it. This may take a few times to get the jet in the right position. On behalf of AutoMD, I'm Barbara Terry with how to replace your washer fluid reservoir.